Okay, so I'm just going to pick up exactly where we left off because I'm going to try to figure something out where I can attach the two videos for today. Um, I was just really on a roll, so of course that would happen. Okay, so somebody wants to put a wedge between you and your work. Okay, so either, either, I don't know why I was going to say either, for, um, Lonnie, okay, I don't know what they're saying there, but anyways, there's something to do with your work, okay, your work being rejected, so either through the internet, okay, or on like some sort of like, <sighs> some sort of hacking thing, okay, because like, I heard my son say, um, what did he say this morning? I hacked the damn thing. I hacked the damn thing. Okay? So, it's to do with your work. My son was like, I hacked the damn thing. And I was like, that's relevant. <laughs> you know? You know how I am. Like, I'll picture it up everywhere. And I'm like, mm, now I know. Thank you, spirit. <laughs> right? Because I'll ask, let it come to me. Okay? Allow it to come to me. The signs, the synchronicities. Allow it to come to me. I'll do, I'll read it to the best of my ability. So I literally read everything around me. Okay? So, and then my son said that. I hacked the damn thing. Right? So it's like something to do with your work in order for it to be rejected. Okay? So that they will no longer be left out in the cold. And this is what they manifested. They want to be, be able to manifest, continue to manifest, continue. So they've been doing this. Manifest toxicity. A man to go down toxicity. Okay? And take a leap of faith with them. But in order to do this, they need to block your work so that this person stops looking at your work. So that they can move into calmer waters. But the thing is, motherfucker, you just fucking, you just made yourself known, man. You made yourself known. You made yourself known. So whether this be a woman or like say, say it's someone you're in a relationship and they got someone else to do it. Okay. They know that you're in relations with that person behind the scenes, right? To have these ships come in. And that's why this person's walking away from you to begin with and protecting themselves from you. is because you tried to cause endings in their life. Okay. Alongside a group of people. Okay. You were a traitor. You were a traitor and that's why this person doesn't want to be with you because you fucking tried to ten of swords them. Tower moment. Okay. And now you made yourself known. IP address. I'm getting IP address. Something like sufficient, sufficient um, evidence. Sufficient evidence. I'm getting where you situate. Situate a situation. A situation. Ooh, damn. Like, this could be like a place of work. Like, maybe you did this at a place of work. And now you want peace. Because this person's being very direct. And you think it's because this person's listening to someone to work. But it's like, it's more than that. It's more than that. A messenger. Some, somebody's speaking truth on this person's name. Somebody's speaking truth on this person's name. Bringing information that makes you anxious. Exposure. This could be like a witness. Yeah, that's the truth. This is a witness. Somebody's a witness. Somebody's a witness. How many? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six witnesses. There's like six witnesses or six surprise witnesses, whatever that means to you. This community is going to become burdened because they were greedy. They were greedy when it came to someone's investments. They invested a lot of time in this. One, two, three, four years. Four years. Damn. This is a fucking, like, this is a big thing. This is a big ordeal. This is a big ordeal. Tower moment. Exposure. Exposure. 
exposure. Manifesting toxicity. A setup. I'm getting like somebody's entire life was a setup. I feel you, man or woman. Somebody could just be now recognizing this, okay? When I first recognized this, I didn't want to believe it. Just like these people don't want to believe that I'm gifted, I didn't want to believe that the truth of what they were doing to me. Because I would never do that, right? My, my, my conscience, my moral value, my integrity, my way of being just wouldn't allow me to be like that. So I didn't think it existed. Okay, but then I, I got more and more intuitive and more and more creative with my gifts. And I'm aware of a lot of things. A lot of things that I, I, I would never be able to do myself. But it happens. It happens. And that's just years and years and years and years of deflecting, of projecting, of having those wounds fester. Okay, so I'm going to pull, I wanna pull the cue cards, a messenger. There's something about somebody following their dreams There's something about somebody following their dreams when it comes to um, making opportunities for themselves. I'm getting like so. This, this is just so beautiful. I, I feel like I feel like this is being neglected for a while. Maybe somebody um, was talking in your ear and, and telling you that it's a foolish plan to do this for work, but they wanted you to continue to work at what you were doing so they could get you caught up somehow. So it's like not only did they not believe that it wasn't a good idea, it's like they don't even believe in self. So why would you take this person's opinion as credible? Like, what do they do for work? Or not even that, not even like comparing, but I mean, like, why do you put that person up on a pedestal above your own decision making, above your own self? Okay, you know that this was a good idea. You know it. This is your dream, for fuck's sake. It's your dream. Even even if it, it wasn't a good idea, it could be manipulated in like a certain way where you can make money off of anything, right? So if it's something you're that passionate about, if it's a dream, then of course it's the way to go, okay? When you work when you do something you love for work, it doesn't feel like work, man. It feels like play, right? So go play. <laughs> That's, that's like the key to manifesting a lot of things, right? It's just like really loving what you do. So it looks like somebody's following their dream. <laughs> and this has someone fucking like ten of swords. <laughs> because the energy that they were putting towards you so that you'd work on this other sh like lower class job and I don't mean like lower class job you might make more money doing it but I mean like lower grade when it comes to you and your purpose so this group of people that gathered to ten of swords you now when it comes to do with your work okay that energy has nowhere to go but back because you've taken yourself out of the equation which is is brilliant in this case it's brilliant like it's not an isolation, disassociation type of like blockage. It's like, no, I recognize you as a narcissist. I'm going to block you so that you don't create blockages in my life. Because these people that you were working with or these people that you were like allowing to like manipulate your situation to do with finances, okay, they're very much a blockage. They're very much creating unnecessary blockages. So it's like somebody has gotten the message 
the signs and synchronicities to take a leap of faith when it comes to work and follow their dreams, <laughs> which is beautiful. Or at least they have this idea in their mind the universe is trying to show them what it is. I mean, what it is, ho? What's, um... <laughs> burden these people are so burdened by this that because you're following your dreams okay because you're opening doors of opportunity when it comes to your work you're moving on that's how you know this person's a narcissist because you moving on to more opportunities you working opening doors for yourself and others having this new beginning because of it burdens them that's how you know you have a narcissist on your hands that shouldn't burden anyone like like when somebody's following their dreams you notice how this energy came out and i i couldn't help but smile okay i'm very much an advocate of people chasing their dreams <laughs> i'm always wondering what people's dreams are i'm like what do you love to do Okay, and, and then I'll plant a seed of an idea of what that could be for them, right? Like, hmm. I, I'm just getting hunting. I'm just getting hunting with all these animals. Say, say you love to hunt. Okay, and, and then say the dream would be to have a camp where, where people, hunters come, right? Hunter, I'm getting hunter-gatherer, <laughs> hunter-gatherer, and then this is what you do for work, and God will have his hands on this work because it is what you love, right? That's why I'm an advocate of it, <laughs> to do what you love, and what that might look like for you when you love something, an activity, okay? What that dream might look like for you, and I'll plant that seed so that you grow that seed, okay? that positive seed, that seed of chasing your dream. But the fact that you chasing your dream has people fucking ten of swords, fucking depressed as shit in a dark place, it's like that is your sign that you made the right decision, okay? Oof. It's like, get off me, man. <laughs> get off me, bitch. <laughs> get off me. <laughs> they want you to like they want you to open a message open a message don't open any like email links just because I heard that hacking thing okay well, of course you have your own free will whatever um, but I'm advising that you don't like click any links that you don't already know like read that shit make sure it's yours don't click any random links right now or ever when when has that ever been a good idea somebody works as a high priestess and they're taking a leap of faith of manifesting their work and like this is exactly why they want your work to be like they're a, a wedge between your work, okay, in your work environment, like, um, fucking with your, like, s statistics I'm getting, but, like, fucking with analytics or fucking with, like, views. Someone's fucking with views, okay? It doesn't matter. This person's in their purpose. View or not, they'll continue to work. So not only did you waste your time, money, and energy, you, you fucking put it, you, you put a spotlight on yourself is what you did. I'm getting a spotlight. Don't you see a spotlight, kind of? I see a spotlight. Just because you wanted to, what, send a message that this, this isn't, in fact, their dream? They know it is. They know it is. They feel it, okay? They know it is. Why do you think they've been guided to work on it so hard? Why do you think that they get positivity when it comes to this work? Why do you think they're happier? Why do you think they continue to wake up and choose this path and continue to work and work and work despite what you're trying to throw at it? Despite what you're trying to throw at it. Despite what you're trying to manipulate. Narcissism.
narcissists hate when you catch on, right? Like they'll go crazy, right? Like, like, uh, I'm just picturing like a witch being like, I'm melting, right? They're just like fucking going crazy, like, ah! <laughs> They're like, ah! <laughs> right? They're just like, they, they, they just fucking something in them man something in them just gets tormented that you're not tormented and that's how you know you're dealing with a nar like someone sick in the mind someone sick in the mind where like other people's success torments them it's like that's how tormented you are when it comes to like being destructive when it comes to like targeting other people and their successes in life that's like loser fucking mentality, right? Like fucking mental. Oof. Right? And then when people catch on to that, you're like... <laughs> melting, right? You're fucking melting. <laughs> Disintegrating, I don't know. Fucking burnt out, I don't know. Death to the... Death to the ten of wands, man. You tried to end someone for finances. You were actively working on it. You had your hands in on this. You're busted. Someone's busted. You're busted. You're busted because this person's a psychic. <laughs> or because this person's listening to psychics. <laughs> Ooh. This is why they're trying to fuck with your work. They gather to do this, but you gather to do this to someone intuitive, you dummy. If you're like trying to mess with somebody's work, you're busted, okay? You, that's the end of that because you just shone a, a spotlight on you. See how dark this is? See how dark this is? This spotlight's just shining on your darkness, this group of people. This group of witches. Okay. Or bitches, whatever, whatever, right? Whatever. Whatever. The hierophant, okay? The hierophant. Someone's becoming more spiritual, and and they, this is like an inspired by somebody's work, which is really great. Somebody's trying to follow their dreams now and try to incorporate signs and synchron. Sync Someone's co-creating with the universe. <laughs> Someone's co-creating with the universe. That's so beautiful. Like you can do any line of work and co-create. And a good way to start is choosing to do something that you love. Okay? You can do something that you don't love and still co-create and have it be successful. Okay? Just not as successful, not as fulfilling because it's not something you love, but you're still working with the universe. That's how certain people, they just have really good luck in what they do. Right? They're like... I don't know, this just this person's just so fucking lucky, right? Because they're actively working with the universe, right? It's a flow of things and they have a good understanding of it, of what makes them feel good. Okay? I'm getting a return to sender. You know you know that we're not really supposed to return to sender, right? If somebody's sending me this, why would I want to return to sender? I wouldn't. I wouldn't. And honestly, like, I, I used to do this when I first started, like, getting into spirituality and I knew that I was being attacked. I used to do that. Okay? Now, I just cancel, 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 strong, strong, strong. Cancel, 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 strong, 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 protect my energy. Transmute that shit. Okay? Turn that hate into love and heal me with it. Turn that hate into love and allow it to energize me. Turn that hate into love and let me be more knowledgeable of what they're throwing at me, right? Transmute that energy, not send it back, okay? Because I am nothing like these people. I'm nothing like these people. I'm the creator of my own reality. So why does anything that these people work on me affect me? It doesn't. It doesn't and I'm not going to allow that to manifest, but I'm going to take that energy okay and I'm gonna turn it into something positive to uplift me to make me more knowledgeable to spread positivity okay instead of negativity I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna entertain what they just did you know what I mean why 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 would I 
Okay, I'm above that. I'm above that and I'm gonna use that energy for myself to create, right? That's why we don't return to sender. And that's why I have such great karma, okay? As these people are piling up negative karma, I'm not even balancing that out with a return to sender. Hell no, <laughs> hell no, I'm gonna use that to my advantage, okay? And I'm gonna get even more greater karma, okay? Do not return to sender, people. Do not do it. Take that energy, okay? Transmute it, okay? Whether it be into knowledge, creativity, protection, whatever you choose to use it as, okay? All of the above. Do not return that shit to sender. Don't even fucking entertain that shit. Recognize it. Feel it. Understand what it is. Transmute it. Use it to your advantage. I never returned to sender. I haven't returned to sender for like, probably like four years now. Okay, I always just do, usually I, usually I say cancel, cancel, cancel right away. And then I'm gonna get a good understanding of what it is. Okay, and then I'll allow it to make me stronger. That's why like on that black magic card, you don't see return to sender, you don't see it. You see cancel, 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 okay? Because I transmute that energy inst instead of returning it because that's not me, that's not how I operate. Judgment, nine of pentacles. This is like, Someone's prioritizing self-love. Someone's prioritizing self-love. And it's like, they, they recognize that these people operate out of self-serving self -serving energy. Self-serving energy. So I'm calling judgment on it because I need to start serving myself with love. <laughs> It's like we don't, we don't know, we, we no longer resonate. Someone's choosing to love self over the love of money. And that is beautiful. That is beautiful. So this is why this person wants you to go down this path of toxicity. There's a certain other person who like wants you to go down the path that you choose to go down free willingly in a positive manner to love self and go from there, which is the right thing to do. This is what will bring you fulfillment in life. To total, complete, tippy top fulfillment in life, right? Finding that love and starting from there, growing from there. And this has these people feeling defeated, conflicted in the mind. And trying to convince you that the community is trying to convince you that this is a conflict. It's a conflict of interest. <laughs> That's the truth. That's the truth. They're trying to plant this idea that it's conflicting. It doesn't work. It doesn't work with the plan. It doesn't. It. It's something, right? Whatever they're trying to say. But it's more than one person. Probably about six people trying to convince you that it's a conflict. It's because they're conflicted in the mind because they can't take this path. Okay, they already fucked it for themselves. <laughs> Something like that. Like they're already in too deep, right? They're already in too deep. They already went down that path too far. But I was getting like witnesses or like character witnesses or like some sort of witnesses, like surprise witnesses, like surprise. And they're like passionate, they're excited. <laughs> They're excited. They're excited. Because they've been affected by this, like, heartbreak and pain. They have been. They've been affected by these stagnancies, and, and they're aware of the fact. They know. They know this person's just passionate about their destiny, and, and they got caught up in some sort of entrapment. They know. They already know. Like these people, these witnesses are free willingly going to just say their story. 
okay? And they're going to feel a sense of like, that was the right thing to do because it is, okay? Because something is and somebody did get targeted for no fucking reason, okay? Somebody is wise. People are learning. Um, people are getting signs and synchronicities to just like stick up for like a worker of the most high, okay? A divine being who wants to spread positivity. And sometimes that story, like that, that person has the rankest story. The rankest story, okay? Because they're supposed to help people who are in that state of darkness. How else do you think that those people in that state of darkness were gonna get help, okay? With someone alike. Okay, just like how these these rich men are going to have someone alike be anointed too, right? A anyone who is anyone from any class, clique, situation, okay, there's going to be one of them who has a transformation and all of them are going to see and be a witness to that as well. Okay, that's how everybody gets a chance to ascend. No matter what you are, who you are, where you are, somebody around you is going to ascend and you're going to be witness to that and then you'll be able to choose based on what that person's teaching you. The lessons you learn in life. There's a certain accident. I was getting car accident yesterday too. Because these people refuse to pay you back so they're going to get in an accident. They, they didn't learn their lesson. They didn't reflect. So they're, com they're just having problems. Problems. Problem here, problem there, problem there. It was an accident. It was an accident. I'm like, someone's going to not be focused for like one second and fucking crash, man. Like one second, because I'm getting like these people are paranoid. These people are paranoid. They could be traveling in the dark. Someone could be traveling in the dark or, or under a tunnel or under a bridge in the mountains. They could be traveling in the mountains. Like they're literally not going to be focused for one second and, and run into problems because of deflection okay the opposite of reflect is deflect lesson in reverse they refuse to learn the lesson here very unfocused not focused on the right things right preoccupied like fucking always choosing the wrong thing to be focused on fixated on okay they they choose not to pay it back boom accident accident It could be into like a cauldron or what is that called? I don't know what it is specifically, but it's a fucking car crash. Very much in their pride and their ego. Accountability. A, a lesson of accountability. That's what it's going to be due to their pride and ego. Yeah, I was getting this, seeing the signs, seeing the signs, the synchronicities. Okay, shameless. The divine's bringing balance. Pisces and their homies. Follower. Gemini in the reverse. So a Gemini could probably potentially not um, be a follower anymore. Or this Gemini is very much in their south node and has a bunch of followers, a bunch of homies, but they're a follow, follower themselves when it comes to a Pisces. There's going to be a harmony to, when it comes to the situation anyways. Power to forgive. Yeah, like someone has a resentment for no fucking reason. They just choose to be mean. They're just fucking mean. They're just a bitter, mean, fucking narcissist. <clears throat> Because we're talking about narcissists this reason, right? Always unimpressed. 
unimpressed that you're releasing them. This is what narcissists do. Okay, very selfish person. Very selfish person. They want to win at all costs. This is like a tit for tat. I'm hearing eye for an eye. You know that eye for an eye shit, right? When it's not real, when you're making it up, when you're making this shit up just to be a fucking narcissist, you know that the, when you do that and it's not real, okay, God's going to do this to you for real, based on some real shit, based on some real shit, power trip. So somebody thinks that they have power. Somebody think, thinks that they have control. The only thing you ever have control of is yourself and your actions, okay? And you sound like you suck. So, I mean, you're going to find out. You're going to find out. <clears throat> I'm hearing fuck around and find out. So someone might say that. Somebody might say that. And I'm also hearing broad daylight. Broad daylight, fuck around and find out. Damn. The ancestors hear you. The angels hear you. God hears you. Weapon in the reverse. Pass. Someone passed a test when it came to picking the right team. And these people are unsatisfied. <clears throat> Police in reverse. Ooh, damn. Somebody could be losing their job as a police. They're, be like, they're gonna be like, give me your weapons. Give me your weapons. You're untrustworthy. You're being held accountable. You're being held accountable. Give me your, give me your weapon. Okay, you operate out of jealousy. Okay, you have no greatness in you. Okay, this person has more integrity than you. You have no love, you operate out of hate. Like, give me your fucking badge, give me your weapon. Okay, you obviously work for the other side. You're a fucking criminal. Someone's going to jail. There's a cop going to jail. Good. Good. <laughs> and that's karma for entrapment. Mm -hmm. It's karma for entrapment. Okay, this is where you'll be able to reflect. This is where you'll be able to reflect. Debt. Virgo. Could be a Virgo who's really attracted to somebody. Addiction in reverse. There could be a Virgo who's getting over a sex addiction. <clears throat> There's somebody stealing work here again. Somebody's like growing past their parental issues. Like they have a good understanding of why parents are how they are, okay, because they had someone even worse off than them, right? So somebody's getting a good understanding of that and able to grow when it comes to, like, these resentments. Maybe they think that their mom is this, or maybe they think that their dad is this, right? Whatever. And they have, they have these resentments, Aquarius. There's, like, an Aquarius who is trying to convince you that somebody isn't the one, Okay? But, like, that's just not true. That that bitches be crazy. Like, they, they, tried to con they tried to say that they're protecting you from this crazy bitch <laughs> who is trying to set you up. And this is how you'll, this is how you'll avoid jail. They made this a priority in order to, like, convince you that you're making the right decision. Like, urgency. I'm getting urgency. They're watching. They're watching you try to sabotage someone's creations. Okay, how they're not even entertaining your gossip. Okay, they know that this isn't true about them, all these rumors. They know that it's actually the opposite. This person could be like not even having sex, abstinent, right? They've raved, raised their vibration. They've risen above all of this shit. Okay, they don't even fear it. There's no backpedaling out of this. Okay, you're not backed by God. Okay, this other person is. Return to sender in reverse. Okay, they're not even returning to sender. Okay, I, I was going to take this card out. But a lot of people are still doing this and they shouldn't. Okay, so I'm going to keep it in because I know of how many people are still doing this. 
but it's in the reverse, okay? How you reverse this is cancel, 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 protect your energy, okay? That's how you do it without getting any, like, fucking backlash. That's how you really capitalize on these haters, right? Because they're getting negative, negative, neg negative, okay? But you returning it to sender is, like, balancing it out. So it's, like, they'll get negative, 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 okay? And then you canceling it will be, like, Okay, it's like you're stepping on their back just to get higher, right? It's like they'll sink and you'll just rise. I don't know if I like, I don't know if that's the greatest metaphor. Okay, there could be like somebody, there could be a Taurus trying to say that they're pregnant or a Leo trying to say that they're pregnant by a Taurus or Taurus trying to say they're pregnant by, by a Leo. But it's because they don't want you to be hostile towards them anymore and they think that the way to your heart is to be pregnant. They don't want to have to pay you out. Or like that baby wasn't yours and they're going to have to pay you out. Okay, for all the money that they manipulated out of you. And that's karma. That's karma. Okay, so I'm going to try to combine these videos. But who knows? Who knows? So. They're, they're like in debt now. It's like they're worse off. They're worse off than when they tried to scheme, right? You got the adverse effect, okay, because they're negative. And you went from, like, being, like, not as negative, but, like, around these people. So it affected you, obviously. But um, to cutting these people off and then becoming really positive. So it's, like, I don't know, a lot, a lot of jealous energy. Jealous that you're happy, but I mean, they could attain this too, but they just have like a mindset of lack because of what they decide to fixate on. It's just loser shit. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know how else to like really um, describe it as a whole, right? It's like haters gonna hate, right? When you, when you try to do good for yourself, negative people around you are just going to do that, right? And that's just your sign that you're doing something right. <laughs> that's just how I see it. Like, I've, I've never not had haters. <laughs> so it's, it's just what happens, okay? <laughs> you're not alone in this, and there is other positive people around a bunch of haters too, and you'll find each other one day, okay? You'll just click because you vibrate the same. And then there will be a certain respect thing because you know what each other been through. Like, oh, I've been through that. Like, this person's safe to connect to. They know. They know what it is. They know how to operate with boundaries, right? It's not going to be the end of the world if I put up a boundary. It's actually going to be like respect mutually, right? So, yeah, that's just what it is, ho. <laughs> I was hearing that song. <laughs> I don't even know that song. I don't even know who sings it. Um, and I was also hearing Work by Rihanna. Yeah, I'm going to try to connect the two videos because, like, that first 11 minutes of the last video was fucking flowing, man. It was flowing. So, um, other than that, have a good day. Um, I'll be on tomorrow. <laughs>